Hey, welcome back to another best of AI video tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you the mid journey killer, or at least that's what people are calling it. It's a really cool new way to create images with text. So let's go right into it. The tool is called audiogram. So what you want to do is obviously go to the website and unlike mid journey, this actually has a website. So you won't actually have to use discord to create those images. You could just do it from the web. So right here, you would enter the prompt that you want and you can actually scroll the trending and you can see that all of these images were created with this service and the text comes out. Now, if you're familiar with mid journey, a lot of the images that you create, if you try to add text to that image, it just comes out like it doesn't come out English. Um, and most of the time it's all made up words. It just doesn't look great. And this service figured it out. So let's play around with that. I'm going to just enter a prompt here um, and I'm just going to say like Spider-Man um, in New York city holding a sign that says venom venom sucks <laughs> and down here you can see you can select a uh, photo poster 3d rendered photography cinematic painting uh, let's just choose photo you can also choose different aspect ratios as well i'm going to click on generate and uh, you'll see here that it's going to give us four different options Unlike mid journey though, I will say that, you know, there's not a lot of customization or like variations that you can create. So keep that in mind. But from what I've been playing around with, it gives you different images that you can use. So let's see here. So you see here, this one, this is funny. So as you can see, it actually put in the text that I wanted. Now, if I did the same prompt in mid journey, um, let's just try it out just to see what happens. But I already know that the image is not going to come out as this would. So let's just see what happens and just press enter. While that's going, let's actually just take a look at what other people are creating with this tool. I think Audiogram is going to be really cool for a poster, um, for stickers, stuff like that, where you really want to have the image and the text be present in the same image. So let's just take a scroll and see what people are creating while Midjourney is creating our image and then we can compare the two. So as you can see, a lot of people are doing like stickers, like this would be a cool little sticker. Like if you took away the background, now you can have that sticker. I actually made a video talking about how you can upscale images and vectorize those images. So for example, if you created something here, you could go and upscale that image and then use vectorizer.ai to then create that vector so that you can go to print or you know create that sticker, whatever the case. Um, so go check out those videos. But as you can see, like text comes out really, really nicely here. Um, this is a cool one as well. <laughs> COVID cornflake, that's funny. Um, best pug dad post no bills. So you can see like you can really get some nice text going when it comes to this tool. Let's check our mid journey to see if anything came out. Um, so you can see here that it did get Spider-Man and these are actually cool versions of Spider-Man. However, the text is just, you see, it's just not like, what is that even saying? It's, it's, I mean, it's cool, but it, it's not saying what we want. And that's the difference between mid journey and this tool audiogram is that audiogram gets the text, right? I said, uh, um, Spider-Man holding a sign that said Venom sucks. And it did exactly that. Whereas mid journey, it just, it just doesn't do it right now. Will I believe that mid journey will come to a point where it does get text, right? 100% mid journey has proven itself that the updates they provide are absolutely, absolutely amazing. So I think they will get it right. It's just a matter of time, but I want to showcase this tool because obviously if we are creating images, sometimes we want to include text and there hasn't been a real, a really good tool that does it as well as ideogram, um, at least from what I've seen. So I wanted to showcase this to just show you that there is an option out there to now create AI generated images with text. So I'll put a link down below so you can go check it out and play with it for yourself. This is a short video, but I was really excited to show you this because I've been playing around with it and it's really cool. Make sure you like this video and hit that subscribe button and go to bestofai.com so you can browse and search over 7,000 AI tools just like this one. That's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.